You telling me somebody bought your dirty ass underwear? Yes. Who bought them? I want to know who bought them. All right, you guys ready? Ready. All right, perfect. Come on, sit down. Reaching high for the stars. Chasing dreams, I'm okay with the scars. Yeah. Cause I have all that I need. Let's take a moment for these things. So one for love, one for life, one for faith. We're the Ace Family. Welcome. And if you're not new here, I missed you. Thank you so much for joining our video today. As you can tell by today's title, I'm gonna be doing a little bit of a friskier video today. So when I do my pranks, I kind of go like outside the box. I kind of do things that I wouldn't typically do. And I've really tested myself over the years. This one's a good one. This one's a little different. I've never done anything like this before. Just to make it super, super short and super sweet. My friend and I were like messaging each other the other day. We're always sending each other like videos and memes and you know, like the normal like friend to friend conversations that we have she sent me this video of this girl who was packaging in um like in these like little envelopes underwear and she was telling uh whoever that she was you know having conversation with she was like i'm gonna mail these out i just sold them and so i was like wait a minute this is actually a really good idea to do to austin like i feel like austin would really be taken back and actually believe this i would never do this god bless anyone who does if you do if you make a living out of this i respect it would never like judge but you guys know I wouldn't do this, but I just feel like he might believe it. Like if I'm doing it and I catch him off guard, doesn't even know that I'm filming and I'm just, I'm packaging all these underwears, right? By the way, all underwears that I have duplicates of. So I just purchased these. I didn't want to actually film my underwear just because I thought that was like a little weird. So I got underwears that um, I actually already own, like similar ones. So he would believe it. And I'm going to be packaging them and putting them in envelopes. I'm going to say that I sold them each for $500. If my equation is right, if I bought 25 underwears and I'm selling them for 500, I believe that's like 12,500. I think my math is maybe a little off. Let me see. 12,500. Yeah, 12,500. Let me see 500 times 25. I'm just going to be like, yeah, I just made $12,000 in a second they sold out a lot of people are doing this my friends are doing this this isn't weird or anything it's like on like um like a private website i don't know i'm gonna make something up we're gonna get his reaction we're gonna see what he says i'm really nervous i'm really really nervous this this is really nerve-wracking because like I don't know if I were a husband or even like a wife you know like if my husband was selling underwear I would just feel like that's just kind of like weird I don't know it just it doesn't sit right but we're gonna see his reaction hopefully we get him in a good mood because sometimes he'd be walking around the house like he's freaking the Grinch okay so <laughs> hopefully we get him in a good mood I was thinking maybe of selling his underwear as well like having his uh, like a little underwear pile of his and actually <laughs> his underwear I don't know we're gonna see catch me in two seconds I'm gonna be uh, you know setting up and I'll see you in a sec oh my god all right oh my god oh my god I'm literally sweating oh my god I just oh it's hot okay so I, I walked into the house and the kids almost blew my cover. Like they were asking me what was in my bag and Austin was literally right there in the kitchen like listening. So they almost blew my cover, but I'm good. So I was thinking about it and I'm like, okay, how am I gonna get him in the bathroom if he literally has no reason to be in the bathroom? So I'm just gonna have to call him and ask him to come bring me some Ziploc bags because I really did actually forget Ziploc bags and I need them for my video. Um, or I need them to like package them and send them out. So I'm just gonna call him and Ask him to bring them. Oh my god, I'm so 
And I have to hurry, by the way, because I was... Yeah. Hey, can you do me a favor, please? Hello? Yeah. Hey, yeah, can you do me a favor? What's up? Can you come upstairs in the bathroom and bring me some Ziploc bags? Uh, yeah. You need to write this second? Yes, please. Uh, I'm kind of busy. Here, right now? Yes. All right, I'll bring it up. Bye. Kind of busy. The hell? All right, I'm gonna hurry up. All right, camera, don't fail me. Do not fail me. Okay. Um, no, it needs to be done more. Come on, camera, don't fail me. Don't fail me. Yeah. Where you at? I got it. Too big and too small. Thank you. Oh wait, can you send me some, um, or sorry, can you give me some more of the small ones? Like maybe like 15 or actually, uh, no, 22 of them. Please. Why so many? Because I'm shipping the underwear out. What is that? What is that? So like this is gonna sound kind of weird, but I literally just sold twenty five pairs of underwear. What you mean, like you got them as gifts? No, like I sold them. Like these are my underwear. And I sold them. What and the fuck are you talking about? So like you sold your own underwear? Yeah. Catherine. What? You lied. I did. Okay, you do not so, sell your own damn okay. dirty underwear. Before you start judging me, okay, I sold 25 pairs of underwear in three bras for literally like almost $13,000 in one second. Like they sold out in one second. Catherine. What? You were lying. You telling me somebody bought your dirty ass underwear? Yes. Who bought them? I want to know who bought them. I don't know because it's anonymous. What you? You just sprayed your own perfume on them too? Yes. Oh hell no, Catherine. <laughs> that shit's illegal. It's not illegal. Where are you selling it? You you where are you promoting this on Instagram? No, Snapchat? no, I would never do that. It's, you not, promote it? it's like on this website where people sell underwear and like a lot of people are doing it. It's not just me. So you're telling me that if you have the opportunity to sell 20 underwear, 25 underwears, and make $12,000 in a second, you wouldn't do it? Yeah. What? There's nothing wrong with it. It's not like I did anything to them. I just wore them one time. And then I wash them. So they're like clean. So people know me. Yes. These shit's dirty. Yes, it's a thing. So can you go get me some more Ziploc bags? Because I have to mail them today. I don't know how I feel about this. Why? Uh-uh. You're not going to send it. Why? I don't think you should send it. Why? Give, give, give them the, the money back. Refund. I can't. What? What do you mean you can't? I can't. It's not refundable. You just like. No refundable. If I take them underwear away, how are they gonna get them? <laughs> Catherine, you just wore the shit. Give it to me. I just see you wear these. Don't these. touch it. You're freaking contaminating it. Catherine. Stop. You said you made how much? Twelve. Twelve thousand dollars from these little ass underwear. Yes. In one second. That, that's like the beauty about it is like I, you can literally post them and then they're sold. 
Immediately. How, how many do you sell? 25. I could have sold how 100, much, I just how, haven't been able to wear 100. How much are you selling these for? That one's 500. $500, Captain? Yeah. You only sell these for $500? And these ones are just 100 but it's just a bra, so. I mean, sorry, no, these ones were 250 Captain. 250 What? Give it to me. Only for $500? Yes! That should be way more. Those are your personal dirty underwear. Girl, your value is way higher than $500 for some underwear. These are your, these are Captain McMahon's underwear. The thing is, is that nobody knows it's me. Nobody knows Wait, what? People are just buying underwear. So I can just sell my underwear? Yeah. You wanted to, I just don't know if people are going to buy it. Well, we'll wait, we'll wait for it. Hell? What up? My underwear dirty right now, but I got a few pairs. Of <laughs> Look, these, these, is, no, these are real clean. Let me think. These, they, they look okay. old, but they're not they clean. All right, so I'm going to have to take pictures. I don't know. Oh my god! What? What's wrong with this? Okay, maybe, maybe not these ones. Well, actually, these, no, 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 no. People like it when it's like a little like messed up. Right? I'm serious. How would you know? I'm saying like. Like they're used. Like this is for real use. There's yeah. There's a hole in it. And you can put my name on those. You can say they're awesome. What you laughing for? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, look at these. I got the Calvin Klein's. These are silky. Feel these. Oh my. Oh yeah. These, we can sell them for a rack at least. Those are so nice. Those are like my favorite underwear. I can get you more uh, by selling them. You're right. I know. So what are we talking about? Okay, so we can sell these for probably like... A thousand. A thousand? Okay, mine ain't as nice as yours. No one is buying these underwear for a thousand. Put my name on them. If you put your name on it, it's different. That's what I'm saying. Should we put our name on it? <laughs> no. no. Honestly, That's nasty as hell. Can you just look over there? This is nasty as hell. Look at this camera, okay? I got you. You're a little nasty. Why did you do that? Come here! I knew that shit was weird as hell. <laughs> You know what's funny? I actually think I, I've heard of somebody doing shit like this. Just say that because I got you. your little nasty oh. ass. I knew you was lying the whole time. No, you didn't. Did. No, you didn't. I was gonna really sell my favorite underwear. <laughs> okay, so not sure if. Not sure if this is. What? You really recorded this? Yeah. What made you think of this? I don't know. Seriously, though. <laughs> no, for real. I think I heard of people doing shit like this for real. Yeah, it's a thick thing. It's not illegal? No, this shit should be a crime. This is nasty as hell. No, Somebody people sell like all anymore. sorts of things. Like people sell like breast, not that breast milk is wrong because that's actually amazing. But people sell like breast milk. Yeah, people I feel like people sell, sell anything nowadays. People sell like dirty tampons. Okay, that's nasty. <laughs> okay, guys, you better like this video. Like, please, 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 please. I mean. Oh, don't like this damn video. Do, You're not even posting this. Do, do what you want. This is nasty. Ace family selling their used underwear. And that's gonna be the headline. Great. All right. So, hope you guys like this video. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. And he left. Did Did you leave? Okay. Did you leave? What? Did you leave? What? I'm gonna really sell your underwear and just see what happens. No, I think that is actually that's nasty as hell. Twelve racks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, I love you guys. Hope you guys like this video. See you in the next one, babe.